Okay, toss-up. Among this island's neighborhoods are Brighton Heights and Tottenville. One can leave... Staten Island. That's power. Way to go, Danny. North on the New York ship. Most. Your bonus for 10 points answer the following about recent airline mergers. In February 2013, this bankrupt airline announced that it would merge with U.S. Airways. This airline has a hub in Dallas-Fort Worth. Southwest. Southwest. Yeah. It's American Airlines. One issue with the merger of U.S. Airways and American can be the combined domination of this Washington, D.C. area airport, where the Reagan. two make up 68% of flights. Reagan. Reagan is correct. Uh, U.S. Airways and American felt pressure to merge to compete with United Airlines, which grew considerably by merging with this other airline in 2012. Southwest. South Southwest. Uh, that's Continental Airlines. So that's 10 on the bonus. And toss-up number two. I'm just going to... September 2007 saw the discovery of the tomb of Idumian, uh, of this Idumian king who ordered the building of a port at Kizera. He had two sons who reigned after him with uh, Malthace and Cleopatra, while Elpis was the mother of his daughter Salome. His expansion of the second temple included the western wall and... Hear it? Very good. No, uh, no, your no, bonus. No, Answer no, the following no. about the life of Abel Mirapal. Under his pseudonym, Lewis Allen, Mirapal wrote the poem Strange Fruit to protest this type of extra-legal mob killing after he saw a photograph of Thomas Shippen. Uh, this African-American jazz singer was particularly well-known for singing Strange Fruit. She also had hits with Lady Sings the Blues and God Bless the Child. Holiday? Billy Holiday. Uh, 1953, Mirapal adopted the orphaned children of this couple, the only American civilians executed for crimes during the Cold War. Or, pardon me, crimes related oh, to the yeah, Cold War. Rosenberg. 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 Very good. 30 on the bonus. Toss up, everybody in. This man explains you, your bait of falsehood takes the carp of truth after ordering Rinaldo to go to Paris and lightly slander his son. One character calls him a fishmonger during a conversation that leads him to conclude, though this madness be, there be method in it. He claims that brevity is the soul of wit, but gives long-winded advice to his son Laertes. For ten points, name the father of Ophelia in Hamlet. Claudius? No. No. It's the uncle. <laughs> Polonius. Toss on number four. In the local Paimon language, this name of the geographical feature of the Gran Sabana is... Karakapakui Venya. The Karate River flows from its base on Ayontepli. It lies Kanaima, it lies in Kanaima National Park south of both Porto Ordaz and Ciudad Bolivar, cities on the Orinoco River. The American pilot who sighted it in 19 Angel Falls. That's good. The military, this military officer had a controversial affair with Emma Hamilton, the wife of British Ambassador of Naples. For ten points, each name this Royal Naval Admiral who won the Battle of the Nile. Uh, Nile. Nelson. Nelson? Yeah. Nelson? Is correct. Uh, Nelson's last battle was this 1805 clash off the coast. Uh, at Trafalgar, Nelson died on board this vessel, preserved today as a museum ship at Portsmouth. Glorious? The HMS Glorious? Glorious? Victory. The HMS Victory. Yet two on the bonus. Toss-up number uh, five. The majority opinion in this case cited the precedent set in Roberts versus the city of Boston. This case was arranged by, arraigned by the city citizens committee who hired the plaintiff's lawyer, Albion Terzi. Uh, it agreed with the constitutionality of Louisiana's separate car act and was overturned by the 1954 board versus Brown of Education. Plus you Ferguson. Correct. The Battle of Waterloo inspired many 19th century novelists. For 10 points, the Italian Fabrizio del Dongo uh, pretends to be a French soldier and rides on the battlefield, and this author authors the Charter House of Parma. Mm. Anyone? Stendhal. In this author's Vanity Fair, Amelia Sedley's husband dies at Waterloo, but Becky Sharp's husband survives. Thacker, right? In this French author's Les Miserables, he <laughs> describes a visit to the battlefield and asks his water. You got 10 on the bonus. <laughs> Toss up everybody in. <clears throat> this country's parliament divided over extending the Tal Law, which exempts religious students from normal mandatory military service. Sharing the burden is part of the platform of the Yesh Atid Park. Israel. That oh, is a God. power. Thank you. Uh, for 10 points, name these amino acids. This only are... Acryl amino acid has a hydrogen side chain. Uh, glycine. 
This sulfur-containing amino acid is coded by, for by AUG, the start codon. It has a methyl theo and other group in its side chain. Anybody? Um, methyl. What do you mean? Um, methyl. Methyl. Uh, no, it's methionine. Methionine? Uh, methionine? That sounds better. Uh, this amino acid's thiol side chain forms disulfide bonds that are important to protein fun folding. Protein folding. Okay, that's uh, cysteine. cysteine. So nothing on the bonus. Toss up everybody in. This altar, wall, this altar wall fresco shows the Pope's master of ceremonies who denounced nudity in holy art as Minos. It may have had the self-portrait of its artist in the flayed skin of St. Bartholomew. The new theory of heliocentrism may have inspired its apostles. Uh, its new theory of heliocentrism may have inspired its Apollo-like depiction of Christ, about whom the saved and damned seem to swirl. For ten points, name this fresco of the second coming in the Sistine Chapel by Michelangelo. The Last Judgment? Uh, very good. Yeah, that was a rough night. Is it still filming? Yep. Okay. Nice. Uh, bonus here. Uh, this work's opening allegro in sonata form was exceptionally long for its time. For ten points each, give the nickname of the symphony in E-flat major its composer's third, originally dedicated in honor of Napoleon's victories. Mm. The Moonlight Sonata. Yes, please. It's something by David. Eroica. This composer of the Eroica Symphony also wrote a sixth symphony. Uh, the slow second movement of Eroica in C minor has this form. Charles Gounod wrote one for a marionette. Wow. Hands, please. It's a funeral march. So you got one on the bonus. Toss up everybody in. In 1932, James Norris changed this team's name from the Falcons to a name inspired by his youth in a bicycling club. This team's fans throw octopuses. That's Bauer. Oh, wow. I would have gotten Norris. For ten points, uh, or pardon me, uh, she comes to New Orleans to visit her sister Stella Kowalski. For ten points, name, name this woman who loses her home, the plantation of Belle Reve, and says that she has always depended on the kindness of strangers. No, not Stella. No, it's Belle. <laughs> Blanche. 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 I'll take that, Blanche Dubois. Okay, so Blanche Dubois appear, appears in a streetcar named yeah, Desire, played by this author at the Glass Williams. Man. Uh, in this Williams play, Maggie pretends to be carrying her husband's husband Brick's child to earn favor with Big Daddy Pollock. Um, that's Menagerie or Cannon Hot Tin Roof. Hot Tin Roof? That's all of them. 30 on the bonus. Okay, <laughs> toss up everybody in. These structures can have screw dislocations along with frankel and interstitial defects. Their structures can be determined by using x-ray diffraction, and their growth can be induced by addition of a nucleation seed. Amorphous solids are contrasted with these structures, which may have units... Crystals. Uh, yep, and you just got the power on that. Uh, your bonus over here. Uh, five people, including Crispus Attucks, died during this incident. For ten points, Boston Davis. Boston Massacre. Uh, the future, this future president defended Adams. Uh, this group gave the Boston Massacre its name. Two years later, members of this group burned a British ship named the Gas Bay yes. in Royal Sons Island. of Liberty. That is all of them. Toss up, everybody. In. A Woman's Worth and How Come You Don't Call Me appear on this artist's debut album, Songs in A Minor. In one song from... Alicia Keys. Best Bauer. Mm -hmm. A skit called Who's On First in the teacher or in a comedy duo spot in the Baseball Hall of Fame. For, their for 10 points, answer the following about the skit. Oh the skit was originated by these two comedians. Uh -huh. Oh, I don't know that. <laughs> <laughs> relax, like relax. Stephen Colbert and John Lewis. Uh, Abbott John and Costello. John in the skit, this was the name of the player on second base. Uh, who's on first? Just come through. Oh, wait, that's good. Yeah. Uh, Ian Kinsler. <laughs> what? No. And this was the pitcher's name. Oh, I know. please. Today. Who? Wait, oh, today? Tomorrow. You don't say that one there. <laughs> yeah, <it's bad. laughs> so nothing on the bonus, and that's the half. And at half, we have 150 to 100. So tight game. And we will start the second half. Right. Now, uh, we're actually uh, going on to question number 11. 
In court, this character's attorney objects that his arm was in a sling on the night of July 14th. He uses a fountain pen to fix an anesthetizer uh, and drinks brandy before flying a mission to take out an ammunition dump. This greatest pistol shot in the world is also told to buy overshoes and puppy biscuit on a trip to Waterbury. For 10 points, name is James Thurber. Name is James Thurber, character who fantasizes about a secret life. Oh, Walter Miggy? Say it again. Walter Miggy, no. No, it's Walter Mitty. Mitty. Walter Mitty. Wasn't that the name of the Yeah. I was thinking James. Okay, toss up everybody in. One form of this condition can be treated with tissue plasminogen activators. Warning signs for that type include TIAs. A clot ascending from the left atrium can cause this embolic type. Aphasia and paralysis can result when occlusion... Stroke? Uh, that is correct. Your bonus is... Uh, this, the area of a triangle is given by one-half times the length of one of these line segments times the length of the corresponding side. For 10 points, name these line segments, each of which connects a vertex of a triangle to its opposite side, forming a right angle with its opposite sides. Altitude? The altitudes of a triangle intersect at this point, which can be found in the Euler line. Central or centroid? No, centroid is um, it's a median. Answer, please. Centroid. Orthocenter. Or the ang this, uh, pardon me, the angle bisectors of a triangle meet at this other point. The center of the circle that is tangent to all three sides of the triangle. In center? Answer, please. In center? Is correct. Uh, isn't it <laughs> All right, your toss-up. An attack on this man's work by P.L. Müller led to his involvement in the so-called Corsair affair. That followed Müller's critique of this man's stages on life's way, which discusses the three existent spheres of life, including the aesthetic and the ethical stages, discussed in a book by this man that includes a seducer's diary. For ten points, name this author of either or a Danish, a Danish existentialist. Spinoza? Nope. Uh, Soren Kierkegaard. Um, In his first presidential election, this man won all but three states, which went to the Federalist Rufus King. Four years later, only a single electoral vote cast for John Quincy Adams prevented him from winning a unanimous victory. He served as Secretary of State under his predecessor, fellow Virginian James Madison. James Monroe. That is correct. That count? For ten points, answer the following about... Uh, about feet used to symbolize vulnerability or loss of power. This Greek warrior was vulnerable except for Achilles. a spot. Uh, mm -hmm. This loyal Jew interprets a dream about the destruction of a statue by a stone which strikes its feet uh, that were made partly of clay. Uh, Abraham? No. Isn't it Daniel? It is Daniel. Two vast and trunkless legs of stone stand in the desert are the only still dies. upright. Yep, very good. What? Ozzy and Dice. All right, toss up everybody in. This play's author claimed that the Eugene Delacroix lithographs for it surpassed his vision. A novel set in America using its theme, The Year the Yankees Lost the Pennant, was adapted into the musical Damn Yankees. Black Sox. Uh, the song De Mort La Lerdent Flame, uh, in an opera based on it by Hector Berlioz, is sung by Marguerite. The title character deals with uh, Meph Mephistopheles, and for 10 points, what play by Johann Wolfgang von Goethe? Faust. Faust is correct. I kind of blanked out. Like, I knew what it was. Okay, here we go. Some of the rivers that flow into this bay include the Nervion and the Loire. For 10 points, name this bay bordering France and Spain. Biscay. Yeah. Bay of Biscay? Incorrect. No. It's the Bay of Biscay. Um, I thought you were saying that. This city on the Bay of Biscay lies at the mouth of the Nervion River, and it's the most populous city in the Basque country. Answer, please. Gilbao. Uh, this French port at the head of the Gironde Estuary, 40 miles inland from the Bay of Biscay, is the capital of the Aquitaine region and is a wine oh, industry it's center. It's Bordeaux. It's Bordeaux. My question. <laughs> that was, we did sample questions for our presentation today, and the answer to his was Bordeaux. Oh, excellent. Um, toss up everybody in. This author of My Uncle Oswald described encountering a black mamba while serving in the RAF in his autobiography, Going Solo. One of his characters tips over a water glass containing... Rodel. That's a power. Oh. Yeah, huh? 
James and the Giants and the Charlie Chocolate Factory. Pedro I was the first emperor of this country after he gained independence. For 10 points, name a South American com country which abolished slavery. Brazil. Uh, Pedro I was born in this European country, the former Colombia. Uh, both Pedro I and Pedro II were members of this royal house, which ruled Portugal until 1910. The Braganza. The Braganza. 30, or two on the bonus. Toss up everybody in. He composed the tenor aria A Mea Mi for an opera about a girl named Marie and included Il Dolce Suono in an opera about feuding Scottish families. In one of his operas, Niamorino describes his love for Quanto El Bella and sings Una Furtiva La Grima. After buying a potion uh, from Dulcamara, the daughter of the regiment is by for ten points. What composer of the bel canto operas the elixir of love and Lucia de Lemamor? Yes. Giochino. No. Tosca. It is Gitano Donizetti. Or Donizetti. The idealistic track anti uh, was uh, Machiavel was written by this ruler who agreed to an alliance with Britain under the Westminster Convention, part of the 18th century diplomatic revolution. This leader's Rococo Palace, Sans Souci, was constructed at Potsdam, and his victory over Austria in the Battle of Molwitz cemented his control over Silesia. For ten points, name this enlightened despot a great king of Prussia. Frederick the Great? That is correct. Oh. Um, many of them lived on Mount Pelion, where they notoriously got into a fight that married, uh, that marred the wedding of Perithios, king of Lapis. For ten points, name this kind of creature from Greek myth, which included the healer Chiron. Yeah, centaurs. Centaurs were, you, were descended from this king, who thought he was going to bed Hera, but instead slept with a cloud created by Zeus. Dope. I have no idea, I've not heard that one. I thought they were from Kronos. Kronos? It's Ixion. Uh, the death of Hercules was brought on by this other centaur who gave Hercules' oh, his wife, Dineria, a poison Nessus. shirt soaked in his yeah. own blood to kill the hero. Nessus. It's correct. It's two on the bonus. Okay. Can I? Yep. Yep, guys. Would you two years? All right. Uh, your next toss up, everybody, in. We have uh, just a minute and a half left. We've got 230 to 160. The number of spanning trees of a graph is given by this man's matrix tree theorem. He characterized the conditions for formation of emission and absorption spectra and coined the term black body. He stated that the sum of potential differences around a closed circuit vanishes, as does the sum of currents in any point. For ten points, name this German physicist who formulated loop and junction rules for circuits. Gauss. No. Oh. Kirchhoff. This man led a force past Fort Hudson to blockade the Red River. After moving his force between Forts Jackson and St. Philip, he captured New Orleans. In another Jackson. In another battle, this commander of the USS Hartford captured Fort Morgan and the CSS Tennessee after the USS Tecumseh was sunk by mines. That was the Battle of Mobile Bay. For ten points, name this Civil War admiral who said, damn the torpedoes, full speed ahead. Farragut? That is correct. Well, that part of me. I don't know. Uh, your bonus. Answer these questions about cloud formation. Uh, one of the main cloud forming processes is the cooling of rising air parcels, which is described by what term indicating that almost no heat is exchanged? Adiabatic. Uh, or adiabatic. Uh, clouds are the visible result of what process that typically takes place on nuclei like dust, which releases latent heat of vaporization. Condensation. Condensation. Condensation by adiabatic cooling occurs above the lifting condensation level, mm -hmm. the point where parcels reach what temperature, at which point water vapor saturation occurs. 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Oh, or yeah. Dew point is correct. And that is the end of the game. 260 to 155. How many eggs did I have? 